Hello, lovely viewers, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into a topic that's crucial for all Etsy sellers and buyers, scammers. Specifically, how they might try to get your email address. So grab your favorite cup of tea, hit that subscribe button, and let's get started. 1. The Etsy Scam Landscape Now, before we jump into the details, let's understand the landscape. Scammers are like weeds in a beautiful garden. They pop up everywhere, and Etsy is no exception. They create multiple accounts, send generic messages, and often target sellers of high-priced items. 2. The Email Request Scam Picture this, you're a seller, and you receive a message from a potential buyer. They seem interested, but here's the red flag, they ask for your email address. Why? Well, they claim it's for payment processing, or further instructions. But beware, legitimate buyers don't need your email to complete a purchase. 3. The Phishing Message Scammers love phishing. No, not the relaxing kind by the lake. I mean cybercrime, they'll send you a message that looks like it's from Etsy. But here's the trick, if it doesn't appear in your from Etsy folder, it's likely a phishing scam. Don't fall for it before. Common Scammer Techniques Scammers insist to reply via personal email, ask for off Etsy payments, and create urgency. Remember, Etsy won't ask for your password or make unrequested phone calls. Stay vigilant. So, my fellow Etsy enthusiasts, protect your inbox like a dragon guards its treasure. Mark suspicious messages as spam, block the sender, and keep your email safe. And remember, if it's not in your from Etsy folder, it's probably a scam. That's all for today. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your Etsy pals, and subscribe for more juicy content. Until next time, stay creative, stay safe, and keep those scammers at bay.